Hi, this is 2017 AMC 12B uh, question 24. Okay, so here is the question. Uh, quadrilateral ABCD has a right angles A, B, and C, and triangle ABC and triangle BCD are similar, right? So maybe you can draw this, okay? This is AB, angle B is right angles. Angle C, but AB is longer than BC, right? So C is a little bit short. You can make triangle, but both two triangles similar, right? If this is X, this is O, right? So this is X, another one is, okay, uh, this is O, this is also X, right? This is right angles, okay, same thing, okay? So they are similar, right? So uh, maybe someone use like this way. This way, this way. This is the A, B, C, D. But this angle equals this one. They are corresponding angles, okay? But at these times, they are congruent, a little similar way, okay? A little uh, different, okay? So similar in general, similar is what we take this one, okay? Not congruent, okay? So we take this. All right, the next one is, uh, uh, the next one is there is a point E, which is point E in the interior of a triangle A, B, C, D, right? But this time, so when you choose point E over here, okay, E over here, this area, the other area are equal, right? Not 17 times, it can be, right? Because of the same base, same height, isn't it? Okay, so it can be like this one. So this one cannot be over here, right? So uh, the next possible will be E is around over here, okay? Maybe if E is around over here. That is not possible. This is right angle. So uh, this is angle X. This is the angle O, right? Okay, this is A, B, C, D. Now this is E, right? So when you make the line over here, okay? So if this area is K, the other area is what? 17 times K, right? Yeah, that is correct. Okay, so now how to find the area, okay? That's the problem, right? Okay, take a look here. The next one is we need to find AB over BC, right? The ratio of these two sides. So the easiest way you can let AB is X, BC is one. That is the easiest one. Okay, we just use one variable. Okay, you don't have to use two variable. Okay, one variable is much much better than okay using two variable, right? So. Maybe you can take this as A, B, X, B, C, 1, right? Using these two numbers, you're going to find out, okay, the area of all this triangle, okay? 1, 2, 3, 4, right? Okay, this is X, this is 1, uh, this one is how much? We can find this, okay? Now, we're going to find this one. Now, the first one, try this one. The big one. This is angle X, angle O, this is X, this is 1, this hypothesis will be X squared plus 1, right? The next one, small one, okay, a lot of similar, okay? This one is, this one, big, all right. So this is angle X, this is angle O, all right? This is still 1, yeah? This is still 1, right? This is A, B, C. Uh, this one is B, C, D, right? Now, the length of B, C is 1, right? B, C is 1. For me, we can divide by X over here, isn't it? Maybe that's the easiest way to divide by X. That is 1, right? When you divide by X, that is 1. That is the corresponding side. So, divide by X, divide by X, right? So, C, D should be equal to 1 over X. This one is square root x squared plus 1 over x, right? Okay, that's fine. Now we delete this one.
Okay, so we just find out the length of this one is uh, 1 over x, right? Now, we need to find uh, the length of BE. I'm going to take this one out, okay? A little make big. This is B, E, C, right? So this is one, okay? Now, how to, what is the length of B, E? Okay, B, E equals, what is the B, E equals one times, right? Using this number. So we're going to find out the ratio of this side, okay? This side, where is the take law? Hypothesis to the what? This one, right? So 1 over the ratio of this side to hypothesis will be 1 over x squared plus 1, isn't it? So it will be what? It will be just b equals 1 over square root x squared plus 1, right? We just got this one. What about EC? What about EC? EC is what's here? 1 times x squared plus 1 over the ratio of this side equals what? x over here, right? Times x. So this one will be x over x squared plus 1, right? Okay, that's it. So to find the area of this one, to find the area of this one, we need to find the height of here, right? This height. Another triangle is what? We need this side. This is h1, this is h2. Maybe this H1 can be obtained from here, right? So H1, H2, isn't it? So we're going to make perpendicular line. This is angle X. This length is H1. This is H2, right? Okay, used to, using the similar again, we need to find H1. So H1, okay, equals how much? We start from this side, okay? Hypothesis. X squared plus 1 times What's the ratio? We can use this ratio, okay? What is that? What is this? 1 over hypotenuse, isn't it? So 1 over hypotenuse. x squared plus 1. This is actually 1 over, oh no, no, not square root. Okay, the same numbers, just 1. x squared plus 1, right? That is h1, okay? So h1, this length will be 1 over x squared plus 1, right? Now we're going to find out this h2, right? h2 is over here. h2 can be obtained hypotenuse 2, right? So x over x squared plus 1 times the ratio over here, what is that? The ratio is what is that? x over this one, right? So x times x squared plus 1 will be x squared over x squared plus 1, right? So the height over here actually equals x squared over x squared plus 1. Okay? Now, yeah, we are done, right? Now first, try find out triangle B, E, C. This one, triangle B, E. EC. Okay, this one is what is that? Leg times leg divided by two. We already got two leg over here, right? Okay, so triangle BEC, area of this triangle BC equals what is that? 1 over 2 times, right? 1 over square root x squared plus 1 times x over x squared plus 1, right? Square root. Actually, how much? 1 over 2 x over x squared plus 1. Right? Yeah, that's the area of a triangle BC. So, what about triangle CDE over here, right? CDE, this one. Okay, this is the base, this is the height, right? So a triangle C D E equals one over two 
base is what, 1 over x times height is what, x square over x square plus 1, right? So 1x is out, so we still got what, 1 over 2, x over x square plus 1. Okay, now take a triangle A, B, E, right? Triangle A, B, watch the area this one. That's the image before. 1 over 2, base is now x times, height is what, 1 over x square plus 1, right? So same thing, 1 over 2, x over x squared plus 1, isn't it? Okay, as you can see, all the area is equal, right? All the area is equal. So, if this is k, this is k, this is k, this is 17k, all together is 20k, right? Okay, so the area of this quadrilateral ABC is 20k, right? So 20k, take a look. Quadrilateral. A, B, C, D, of course, 20K, 20 times, 1 half X over X squared plus 1, actually equals what, 10 X over X squared plus 1, right? That's the area, okay? Okay, now, I'm going to find out the area of this one in different way, okay? Looks like, what is that? Trapezoid, isn't it? Trapezoid over here. This is, I'm going to use this one, okay? 1 over X. Upper base, base 1 plus base 2 times height, right? Divided by 2, right? That's the trapezoid. Okay, now take a look over here. I'm going to use trapezoid in a different way, okay? Different way. There we are. Okay, using trapezoid. Base is x. Lower base is 1 over x times height is 1 and divided by 2, right? Actually, this one is, what is that? x squared plus 1 over 2x. Yes, 2x. But these two areas should be equal, right? This area should be equal. Now we're going to find out the value of x, okay? Almost done, right? Almost done. I'm going to use this one. So finally, we can say 10x over x squared plus 1 equals x squared plus 1 over 2x, okay? Cross multiplication, x squared plus 1 squared equals 20x squared, right? x is a positive, so we can make a square root. Fine, you can say x squared plus 1 is what? Square root 20x. Right? Now we need to find the value back. This is a quadratic equation, okay? So from you start from here. x squared minus red 20 x plus 1 equals 0, all right? Using quadratic formula. x score, what is the negative? b is what? Red 20 plus minus square root. Red 20 squared is what? 20 minus 4 times a is what? 4, yeah? Uh, you need divided by a is what? 1, 2. So this is 2 red 5 plus minus 4 over 2 equals red 5 plus minus 2. Right? We have two choices. Red 5 plus 2. Red 5 minus 2. But x is greater than 1. It's given, right? This number should be greater than 1. But this is not greater, this is less than 1, because this point is what? 2 point, something like this one, right? So minus 2 is what? Just approximately 0.23, yeah? this is not greater than 1, right? Less than 1. So we take this one, okay? So the answer, okay, x will be, okay, a, b, 2, b, c, if that's the ratio, equals red 5 plus to each dance, okay? It's a lot of work, but we just uh, apply similar, very quicker, right? So we can finish, uh, okay, in uh, maybe uh, one or two minutes, okay? All right, thank you so much.